Hey guys, what's going on? Brian back with another video and today guys will be the big move. All right, we're going to be uh, moving my group over to Trumbull Valley. So just so you guys know that it's legit, as you can see, like my supplies and stuff, obviously I'm going to get more materials because everything's going to, all my level threes and all that's going to break down and I'll be refunded. But um, all of this stuff is coming with us, all our stuff we have. All of our people. That's it, guys. We're going to be moving all of these guys over to Trumbull Valley. All right. The um, only thing I'm not going to be able to keep, guys, is my vehicles. But I figure that's fine. Uh, we should be able to farm some vehicles over there. And also, guys, I'm uh, upgrading, making the game harder. Um, adding Pathogenesis, which is the uh, mod that um some people are really getting on my nerves all right stop talking it's the uh mod that uh makes blood plague more deadly and uh obviously being in trumbull valley we all know that it's all blood plague so that's uh definitely gonna be a challenge but i'm lo really looking forward to it and i hope you guys are also looking forward to it and um we'll see you guys on the other side peace all right guys and here we are we are in trumbull valley here at the jurassic junction base we have as you can see all our materials all of our resources are still intact our supply locker still intact everything is good guys so um and all of our people are intact everybody made it to trumbull no problem gas. Watch it pour. It's made from a dinosaur. <laughs> well um as of right now everything's going pretty good guys i uh previously i moved a group over to uh trumbull to uh do some testing and um it broke the game it like broke the heartland story mode it um the game like didn't know what to do because of i got rid of all the people from heartland but now uh it seems to still be intact i don't i don't know what's gonna happen after this but for now we'll uh oh, damn that that is some good news mm -hmm. yeah we should definitely have some cure in stock all right so let's take um Chavez needs some more leveling, right? And so does Mango. So let's roll Mango. We gotta get to work on this place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Use some help. And, um, this is officially the end of crafting only, guys. Um, now that I'm playing with such, uh, high-level mods, um, I'm going to allow myself to kind of just loot whatever. Um, the only thing I'm not allowing myself to still do is, it is, uh, buy guns from traders and, uh, stuff like that. So if I want guns, I still have to loot them or craft them. But that's it. I can only loot them. So no buying BFGs from traders and stuff like that. If I want guns, I have to acquire them on my own uh, by either looting or crafting. So that is still a rule, guys. All right. So let's see what we can. Uh, let's get some meds, some stamina items. We're good on ammo. And I think we'll roll with that and go on a loot sesh here. I think we can start off. Yeah, we'll start off behind, get some... Yeah, hit these three. Um, The one thing I did lose, guys, is my backpacks. Uh, and that was kind of my fault with uh, doing the file transfers. I um, deleted all my backpacks off my characters. So that's another thing we're going to have to keep our... That's kind of. It's kind of cool, guys. That um. 
the missions have actually stayed intact. So uh, we'll see how this works out, guys. I, I didn't expect uh, to move these guys over and the missions stay intact. Uh, the last time I did it, the game completely shit the bed. Uh, no missions were spawning, no enclaves were spawning, no nothing. Oh, this might be useful. I hate when that happens. There we go. But here we are in Trumbull, guys. Definitely going to enjoy this. Yeah, could be worse. And from this point forward, guys, we're going to be playing with, um, nice, a lot of 44 Magnum rounds. We're going to be playing with uh, these harder mods. And uh, I'm going to try to be the first guy to do a 100-day challenge with uh, mods. Try to get me. everything we can possibly find what is that it's just a plague zombie Right. It's locked. Uh, you can stealth open. Case behind the door. So, seeing as I actually got this to work, guys, I'm definitely going to try to take my time and enjoy the map. Um, I haven't really had a chance to loot out and, like, explore the old Trumbull Valley map. Go and look at all the old places and stuff like that. Um, we really haven't been able to enjoy that, especially in my last Heartland playthrough. Or Heartland playthrough. Not that I regret how I played it, but um, we kind of burned through it pretty quick just to get it done, you know, to beat it. And um, that was the goal. That was the goal anyways. But now this time being here with my main 100-day, you know, community, let's we're going to actually try to enjoy be in here explore the map a little bit this isn't clear oh. and now guys right now i'm currently only playing with Who's level two pathogenesis um so eventually i will be bumping it up to the full level three patio but um Trying to just see how the balance is on this one before I go with the... Because the uh, level 3 Pathio is designed for modded characters. Um, obviously, I don't use modded Halo characters. Oh, we actually got to upgrade that. So we'll get that upgrade in. I um, I put I got a Trade Depot in here because I can't use the... Uh, whatchamacallit? Facility. Um, I couldn't use the Quincy Facility... And I couldn't use the farm complex because I killed everybody. Um, but this acts as a... Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Um, okay, so this is our quote-unquote medical facility. All right, cool. I won't be able to use that... Um, but there is enough slots here, guys, for me to um, run this without uh, using any special Heartland facilities. I, I went and I did the the calculations, guys, and there's more than enough slots. Um, so we'll, we, we should, we'll be all right. We just won't be able to craft all the crazy uh, Heartland stuff. Let's go grab that bag of food really quick. How long until... Uh, Five minutes. Oh, 
Oh, a jug. It's like deja vu when I came here with Prime and uh, Solus. A jug spawned over here also. I don't want to be near that bloater when it pops. Just gotta be careful with. Oh shit, that jug's going for the base. He can very, very easily kill um, people yeah. in the community. Ahead. Watch. Oh, what are you shooting at? Is there another bloater? So I downed one. Oh, no, the jug's over there. All right, we're good. We're good. As long as he's not... I thought he was running into the base. We're probably going to have to fight him eventually, but... Right now is not a, that time, so... We'll actually um, see if we can fix up this... Uh, this car we did start with out here. Let me see if I... Craft a toolkit. We got a horde over here or something? Yeah, everybody, everybody lost their backpacks because I'm an idiot. I say we get to work on building a new facility. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so let's go. Um, let's go see how much of this game stayed intact. Let's grab our this and that. I doubt I'll be able to do the whole Heartland, guys. Um, it just isn't very uh, practical. For the, come on. I just want to repair the damn car. Travel to the home of the Wilkerson's. Things are working out. I feel good. I feel good. Da -da 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 -da. I knew that I would. Whoop. Whoop. All right, guys. Uh, I Damn. had a little bit of a hiccup there in the system. I don't know what the hell happened. But, um, yeah, should be good now. So... Uh, we got to create a, uh, that and that. Yeah, I don't know what happened. I went to put fuel in the car and game broke, so. Like I said, uh, this isn't a perfect system, so we're probably going to have some, uh, some bugs here and there, guys. Not the game's fault, completely my fault, so. Because uh, what I'm doing here isn't designed. <laughs> you know what I mean? All right, so we are fueled up. Let's get over to the Wilkerson farm, guys. Make sure the back is empty. Because I want space to... Oh, no, it's not. Oh, all right. Um, yes, realistic vehicle storage, guys, is a uh, mod I'm using. So this card now has, uh, and the way the modders put it, if you read it down in the description, they looked at it as storing stuff up in here, storing stuff in the back, in the back seat if you need to. Um, so as you can see, we got three, six, nine, twelve slots for this car. So it's a little bit of, a, kind of a lot, but. Wanted to test out the mod and see how 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 it is. I think the turn to get to the Wilkerson's is uh, down at the trailer park, right? Yep. Down at the trailer park, and I'm oh, guys, I love this map. 
I miss it. So I've played her so much from State of the K1. I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys have too. But to add this map into just the rotation, because I'll be able to do it, guys. I'll be able to rotate this map just as easy. I mean, it takes like five, ten minutes of work on my end. Um, it's really not that bad, guys, in order to come and play on this map. Uh, it wasn't it wasn't too bad. So, you know, I'll be able to do it just like I'm going to Drucker County or anywhere like that. Oh, next time I won't just delete my, uh, <laughs> my backpacks. Like Feral. Yeah, so we gotta be careful though, guys, because Pathogenesis is active, and I'm pretty sure it's gonna whoop my ass if I'm not. Let's go up here and see the Wilkerson's, guys. I remember defending the seat. This is where I met my first juggernaut, guys. Uh, when you come up here. Any plague samples? We definitely want to make sure we're farming plague samples, guys. Due to the fact that there's going to just be a ton of freaking uh, blood plague. We want to make sure we stay up on our, our samples. Yeah, remember, we had to keep boarding these windows up, guys, and then uh, you defend the siege. And uh, that was the first juggernaut that you meet in the... Talk to Nat. Is this Nat? Well, that is Nat. Well, if, are you just going to keep walking away from me? In these parts, folks know how to be nice to their friends. You want to be friends, right? You're smart. I like that. Brock over there can point you in the right direction to find something nice for us. Guys, I don't... It's pretty cool. I, I, I didn't know... We're, like, doing missions, guys. Also... This is gonna come in handy. Oh, nice. Let's loot out their place, see what we can get. So we're, we're, we're neutral with the Wilkerson's, guys. I don't. I, I never played this side of Heartland, so I don't know if this is. Um, that's not Brock. Is this Brock? Brock. I know a place where you can find something that would like. I don't know if this is um, like the regular Heartland missions for the Wilkerson's. Um, you guys, let me know. Travel to that shed. Obviously, we know it's going to be an infestation. Let's see, we'll throw these in the trunk for sure. Throw some seeds in there, the parts. All right, let's head down to this infestation and clear it out. Shouldn't be too bad. Um. I do have the infestation mod on, so it could be pretty bad for all I know. I didn't check the size. i do that if I can get a second clearing. Yeah, I can't see it underneath the uh, mission marker. Yeah, we got to make sure we're watching out for bloaters, guys. Um, they're ridiculously deadly. And uh, Pathio. And I'm not trying to lose anybody right now to a bloater. That water tower. Alright. 
What are we looking at, guys? Ton of screamers. Oh, wow, guys. Yeah, so my infestation mod is definitely active. <laughs> I didn't have any. It's too fucking close. That was nothing. Right? That's one ugly ass juggernaut. Where the hell is a jug? Is he on the other side? I God damn it. Is he coming for me? Yeah, I think he's coming. Yep, he knows where I am. This is a pathogenesis nightmare, guys. One v one. Oh, get out of it, please. You might have to up it to the regular level 3 Pathio because this really isn't that. I expect to take more plague than that. Hmm. It's getting dark outside. I wish I had some fire, guys. How the hell else are we going to take out 18 zombies? We'll go make that an outpost. We can have, yeah, we can have three outposts right now. So we're going to go make a food outpost real quick. Getting pretty goddamn dark outside. Go make this food outpost really quick. Yeah, so I think starting next episode, guys, we're going to bump it up to level 3 Pathogenesis. Which is uh, super duper deadly. We'd be idiots not to turn this into an outpost. Is that empty? Yep. Alright, folks. Yeah, post is up and running. All right, I need. Can I make? I think I can make more in here, right? Yep. Um. I also want to get my filling machine on there. Two minutes, fourteen seconds. It's not bad. We can wait. Uh, let's see what else we can do with the base. Let's get that fixed up. Let's get that fixed up. So can I can actually call for traders? Okay. Because um, normally, guys, you can't use the trader. You can't use the trader um, legacy building in Heartland. It doesn't exist. Uh, so I didn't know if, when I installed it if I would actually be able to use it. But yep, right here, guys, I can actually use it. Let's loot while we're here.
throw that in the truck or the car. Oh shit. Good thing I did that. I almost didn't grab more ammo, guys. Almost did not grab more ammo. Level one tactics. This is all the music from uh, State of K1, isn't it? I actually need to turn the damn music down, guys. A little bit, so it's not blasting my ears out. I don't think I applied it, so it sounds exactly the same. I did. Where the hell did I park oh, on the on the road up there, Miriam? Um... All right, so yep, there we go. Let's uh, hop in here, hop in here, and Molly's. Definitely a feral. Shit, we don't really have a lot of five five six. All right, last mag in. All right, let's try to get the hell away from that feral because that's gonna take. I hate wasting time on places like this. Definitely take a little bit of ammo. That juggernaut took my whole goddamn clip. And that is a big ass horde. No, it's not. It's not that big. All right. Go burn some of these fools. Fire in the hole. Got him. Out of 18 zombies, only got like four or five freaking blank samples. All right, so let's search this shed for the Wilkerson's. Jesus, guys, that was a... All this just to search your set. Uh, wow, guys, words just escaped me there. Step two, find useful stuff. For a case of laser detonators. Could be worse. Definitely haven't found no laser detonators. Hey, not bad. Those are definitely laser detonators. Got an ultralight pack. Car should be right there. Yeah, I think it's literally right there. Not gonna fit. 
Let's go throw some of this in there and come back and get that. Okay, so we can't do shit with those detonators, pretty much, is what it just said. It actually said it's useless to our community. This will slow me down. Might be able to do a little bit of trading with them because I, uh, I don't really need all this stuff I have. I, I feel like I do, but uh, I'm going to sort through it. Because being crafting only for so, so long, I, uh, I don't really have a lot of stuff. So I feel like I can still use a lot of stuff. Just gotta watch for bloaters. There was one on the road over here somewhere. Yeah, he's up past this. They got quite a few zombies just right outside their base. Did not expect that. I need those power tools. Install them in order to drastically ins Um. Yeah, we'll keep that. What can I sell? What do I want to sell? Probably all this crap. We'll keep that soda can bomb. I'll sell that ultralight. What you got for us? Oh, well, ain't that sweet of you? I like you, and I pride myself on being a good judge of character. Yeah, that. Sure, right back at you. We'll see you around. So, what do we got today? Well, sure. Remember, guys, the only thing I'm allowed to buy from traders is rucksacks and mods. I have to either loot or um, craft stuff. Like, how they had mollies, I can't buy them from them. Got to loot them or craft them. They still got their little uh, moonshine business going on up here, I see. See if there was any more containers to loot in here. I know I think I've seen one over here. Yep. We'll go check upstairs. That's where um the brother died. And I shot him. I shot him, guys, in the game. Uh, in the first game. Uh, 
Oh, this place is a lot different than it was. It's a lot more fleshed out. Not as open and barren. Nothing more to find here. Let's oh, go. Smoke grenade. You guys know I love my damn smoke grenades. Hey. Hey there, business partner. Sure, I guess so. Ah, uh, we'll hold off. We don't need to buy that. We do need to freaking make some ammo, though, eventually here shortly. Let's see if I can get maybe, um... That. I'm thinking. Get the kitchen fixed. Upgrade our outposts. So this gives a huge fuel storage. Uh, what does our storage look like? Twenty. Yeah, yeah. We can hold so much fuel. We got to start upgrading stuff, though. We're gonna start bleeding materials bad. How's our inventory looking? Quite a. We actually got a decent amount of freaking inventory left. Uh. I hit that barn. Oh. oh, shit. I knew I heard a feral. I got I got fixated on the bloater, guys. So I was like, oh, shit. head back to the base and then we'll go loot that military complex right down the road see if we can get some goodies from that Try to get me, guys, but I'm I'm, I'm slicker than a can of oil. So my boy Freddy told me. You can't trick a trickster. Alright, so we'll be able to craft some more ammo. fuel you can hear it they uh, added a new audio cue car starts like putting like that you guys can probably hear it you don't you don't need my sound effects you don't need my sound effects all right let's uh, get some more fuel Getting kind of crowded around here. I do too. I think there might be more cars behind the um, the base. Generally, uh, over near that bathroom over there, there's usually a car. Right, let's get some ammo made. Oh, yeah, we got those two facilities being finished um actually we'll uh i was gonna say we should call in a fuel trader but i think we're gonna try to loot some fuel yeah let's go check that uh spot out over here i don't know if there's a car though because i don't see one on the map
Well, damn. Let me out the motherfucking base. Time to go risk my neck again. Yep, there's a van right there. I wonder how many spots, slots that has. It's, well, it might be the same. Yo, they, they don't move a muscle. I'm on my way. They definitely asking us for a lot of stuff, guys. It's a lot of zombies. Holy shit, guys. Did you see that? I don't know. I might be removing that mod. I get it. It's a big ass van. You can fit a lot of stuff in it, but that much stuff there. It's a three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen. I'm losing track. I don't know, guys. It's like thirty fucking slots. <laughs> it's a lot. He said realistic, guys. I mean, I guess it is pretty realistic when you look at the size of the van. Let me go grab some fuel. Hey, plague samples bad, guys. Give me the fuel. So the kitchen is done. Yep. Um. Plus twenty in material. No, nah, we're looking for more like yeah, like this. I'd rather we need power though, which I do have um Chavez, which he can build the he can build the Chavez. Yeah. He can build this. That's the good thing about having Chavez, guys. When we bring him along over here, he's extra good. We should have had our freaking smelting furnace. I forgot I was saving up stuff and I was going to attach that furnace and then break everything down. Don't let me forget next time, guys. Yeah, so let's uh, craft. So I can't make. Yeah, I need an expert in outlaw chemistry. We're not going to be able to. We're not going to be able to do that. All right, so we're going to craft up 5.56. Five, five, How are we looking on ammo? 19. Oh. Right there, that's good. That's good right there. All right, so we're going to put her on uh, base defense. How is her skills looking? Uh, pretty slow. But we're going to hop on... We're going to level up Carol. Level up Carol a little bit. Oh, I didn't give... Uh, I didn't give Mango a base defense weapon, did I? Freaking Wilkerson's wanting stuff. Want me to do stuff. Alright, there you go. There you go, Mango. Alright, Carol. Alright, Carol. Let's get you a backpack. Um... Uh, I guess we could repair this, right? Yeah, we got we got some parts. 
Um, take the suppressor off of this. Because that gun is pretty beat up. And take that. We'll attach that to it. Because we got a little bit of 22 ammo. So I definitely want to make sure we're not wasting all of our 5.56 just right away. Carol, what do you specialize in? Nothing yet. Do we want to give Carol a weapon, guys? Oh, yeah, we'll give her a blade. We'll give her the blade. Meds that. Actually, I'm going to swap her for that. And where's the ammo? A little PP7. Homo. Every time I turn the corner, I find another room. Fuel. Yeah, we need to grab a gas can. Let's go get this uh this van on the road. Come on, Carol. What a Gotta move slow around that sleeping bloater. How is this gun down? Uh, six already. It's not the greatest, but. Literally load half the goddamn map in this damn van. Fourteen parts for uh, one plague sample was not worth it. I hear the bloater. Right there. So this was three containers in here. It must be uh, the back door. To alarm you, but we've got a few too many infestations around here. Yeah, Pathio is definitely cranked up the spawns quite a bit. Are empty. That's what I like. It's nice, though, to play um, game modes that are just hard by themselves that I don't have to limit myself just to make it difficult. So uh, playing like this is definitely enjoyable, guys. Having a... Uh, having to be this stressful. Oh, 
shit. Is that an infestation? Oh shit, Carol. I should reload. Yeah, you should. God damn it. All right, last mag in. I forgot when the game froze earlier, it kind of backtracked a little bit. Then it should be right in. Was it in the dresser in here? Yep. Yeah, the game backtracked then. Need to get all my uh, icons black. I don't like the icons not being blacked out. Because then when I go to... Site secure. There we go. That's what I like to see. All right, so we're going to go hit that military um, checkpoint, and that will probably be it for episode, guys. And I want you guys to tell me uh, what you guys think. Able to move my main community over here. I know a lot of you. I'm going to get I'm gonna get a lot of hate. These guys, they, they message. I mean, some of you guys, you know, especially people that follow me for a while, you know that I, I, uh, I mod. Um... But some of these guys, man, they, they look at the, the thing. They're going to be like, oh, how did you get your main community to Trouble Valley? And I'm going to be like, oh, all you need to do is this. And then they're going to dislike my video because they're, they, they're not going to be able to do it if they're on Xbox. And people get really upset. Thinking I, like, lied to them. And I'm like, dude, I'm not lying to you. I'm just... All right, let's get a little real. It's definitely getting a little real. Damn it. No, don't. I can't keep this up. Let's get that stamina back, and then we can go take this guy. <laughs> All right, squished him up against that. Let's check the back of this truck. We're out of bullets, so we gotta be a little careful. Hopefully, we don't get. Man, it's freaking beams hold a lot of shit, guys. Let's just take them out. One last thing to worry about. Can we kill you on the porta potty? No, we can't. Can we kill you on the fence? Yes, we can. Place looks good. I had a guy dislike my video because I played with no mini map guys. <laughs> he was uh, he was pretty upset about that. <clears throat> Whoa there. All right, we did get some bullets, so let's reload. So we got an AK. Damn, I was hoping for the fuel.
a good ass gun, guys. Slow me down. It's one of my faves too. Also, guys, um, if you see I have equipment on this gameplay that you know maybe you don't have or you want, uh, just let me know in the comments, guys, and uh. I'm always willing to hook you guys up with trades. You know, if you guys want, like, say, one of you guys really like this gun and you are having a hard time getting one, whether you're on Xbox, PC, just no let me room. know and I'll, uh, I'm willing to trade with you guys. You know what I mean? Jesus, guys, this van holds everything. I agree that some of the, the vehicles were pretty skimpy on storage. Um, you know, especially for the size of the vehicle, but that is kind of kind of huge, guys. It's kind of huge. This will slow me down. I mean, granted, it's a ridiculously huge van. And you could definitely fit I could easily fit all of this stuff in there with my eyes closed. Um, is that it for this? Yep, that's it for that. So we got the military checkpoint. Got the operator's M4, but no, um, echo weapons yet. Oh, full auto. Got a fuel can over there. Now that's heavy. Gas can and let's throw shit in there real quick. So I already know I'm not gonna be able to fit whatever's in here. That shotgun's, uh, I've never really used it. I know it's suppressed, but, uh, I was always scared that it was still going to be too loud. Uh, I don't know, it was weird. Might give it a, a shot one of these days. Did not expect to get fuel from here, so that's, that, that's nice. Let me see. Are we losing shit already? As soon as that upgrades, I'll be able to upgrade this. Um, but I'm pretty sure we're bleeding materials, right? Yeah. Let's actually uh, craft... I don't want to go too ham. But I don't also want to just be sitting here bleeding materials for no reason. We actually need to take this off. I'm being dumb, guys. I'm being dumb. Where the hell is my CNC machine? Where is it? Or my CNC mail. God damn it. I don't know where the hell the damn CNC mail is. Well, we're gonna... Definitely get the CNC mill running. There's a lot of 
zombies. Come on. School of School of Brian's the Brian School of Driving, as Prime would say. Should not have been wasting ammo like that just for no reason. Alright, too easy, guys. Looking at resources now. Yeah, we're looking good. That's about to be done. What we need now is some clean running water. Give yourself a couple seconds, dude. Glad we got that done. Yeah. On to the next. Yep, yep, yep. So we got it, bro. All right. So now that we got that, we can upgrade this to this one. Um. So it seems, guys, that I lost all of my um facility mods that were attached to uh my facilities when I moved. It's all good. Let's call this guy. Might not work. If not, we're going to be butt naked out here, guys. Rather than just figure it out. Yeah, I don't think they're going to work. Because they're not programmed into this game mode. Yeah, it's not going to work. That's all good. Can't can't expect everything to go my way, right? But um, it's all. I, I feel like it, we'll be able to. I don't want to really. Uh, I'm glad it doesn't work, because it forces us to have to go out and actually search for shit. It's, and uh, like I said, I. We found a good place for you to search. And I, I really do want to explore the map. You know, I want to get back up in the city up here and actually hit the gun store, hit all the stuff. You know, all them little spots. So, next episode, that's probably what we're gonna do. We're gonna we push up to here, What'll it be? and uh, we're gonna just start looting. And looking around and uh hopefully you guys will just better you know just a little nostalgia that's what i'm looking for and uh like i said we'll see how far these quests go um before they decide to break i i mean next episode i could literally start the game up and they could break but for now we'll ride it out and see how it's going and uh once again hey guys let me know what you think i appreciate you guys for watching and i'll see you oh like subscribe do all that good stuff. I appreciate you guys. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.